What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so in this episode right here, well, it looks like we're going to be going through Route 105. I think that's what it is. Let me see. Let me take a look right here. Hmm. Places. And yes. Okay, so I was correct. So we're going to be going through Route 105 in our little side quest uh, adventures right here because, well, we need to take care of everything that goes on into the west side. Now, off screen, I did replace three Pokemon just for the sheer thing of, you know, I gotta evolve some Pokemon right here. I need to. Actually, I want to. Now, I may have forgotten a little something. Yes, I need to go buy some more repels because good gravy. I've been using up repels like nobody's business. Now, in our last episode, we, yeah, we did a lot. We traveled a lot. And, uh, we got to grab a lot. You know, we did, yeah, we, at least we were just, like, productive and stuff. Shoot. And, uh, well, at least, at least at this point, you are able to grab yourself some, uh, full restores, which, you know, I'm gonna grab some. I mean, a lot. And, well, let's go ahead and, uh, finish it off with some repels right here, leaving me with only 140 Poke Dollars. Don't worry, it will come back. In fact, holy crud baskets, I cannot believe I forgot this. Okay, so, yeah, I'm gonna be selling some items here too, because I think I grabbed, a, I think I grabbed some stuff. Let's see, this ball, oh yeah, we got a star piece, so that's definitely gonna be going there. Uh, star dust, we got two of those, yes. Okay, and if I'm not mistaken, there might be another item here that we could sell for a pretty good buck, and, uh, huh, heart scale, yeah, it looks like, uh, okay, so, yeah, okay, see, we made it all up again, anywho, let's go straight to Route 105, and let's go ahead and take care of business over there, so, let's see, the three Pokemon I replaced... Or the three Pokemon that I put back in, or that I put on my team. Ultra Psycho, uh, Hydra, as you guys can see right here, and Shroomly. That way I can just, you know, that way I can evolve them, you know. Fill up the Pokedex just a tad bit. Maybe use them for later on. I don't know. We shall see. And uh, here we are in Route 105. And yes, we're going to be taking on a lot of trainers right here. So let's go right ahead and see what happens. So here we go, take it on Triathlete Vin, not so diesel, huh? And look at that, he's coming out with a Whalmer. Whalmer, of course, very, very interesting Pokemon. So let's go with an Aerial Ace. Definitely using the wrong Pokemon for this little part. And well, here comes an Astonish. Yeah, not so, yeah, it's definitely not so, uh, what was it called? Uh, not so effective since my Pokemon is a fighting type, but yeah, guess what? Look at that. We win. And, well, Ultra Psycho growing to level 11. Shroomly gonna be growing levels like crazy, too, because, well, they're way underleveled. Look at that. Shroomly already learning its moves. Oh my god. And here comes a Sfeel, so let's go right ahead and switch it out to Gaia the Fierce Knight. So, let's see, guys. Let's see, let's see, let's see. So, there, 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 there's quite a few plans that I have in store for the rest of this walkthrough right here. As many of you guys already know, uh, yeah, this walkthrough, or this game right here, has a boatload of stuff uh, to, to complete. Like, capturing a boatload of it legendaries, um, trading from Pokemon to Pokemon. As you guys can see, Ultra Psycho grows to level 12, Hydra 22, and Shroom Lead to level 9. Holy crud. Yeah, we're, we're stacking up. So yeah, like I, like I was saying, guys, we're, um, there's a lot of stuff that you can actually cover right here, and the plan is to try and switch up some Pokemon, make a new team, or, you know, basically have a, 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 like, have a mega team by the time we end this whole thing. There's plenty of trainers, there's plenty of time to tr to just train the Pokemon to, to, to the best, I guess, to the best of my ability. This game right here, it... Yeah, it has plenty of content and all that stuff. Now, the only messed up part is that... The only messed up part is that I am not playing Pokemon X or Y. Which, uh, you know... 
That would have helped just a little bit with the Kalos Pokemon. Now, as you guys can see, Azuril is not being super effective because... Or, I'm not beating Azuril, Azumarill, I should say, because, well, it's a flying, or not a flying, but a fire and fighting type Pokemon. Quadruple weakness, and that right there is not going to be super effective, so let's go straight for the Electro Ball. For the win. Look at that. Oh, yes. And Tommy JDF grows to level 42. Everybody else, too. Ultra Psycho to level 14. Everybody else is going to be evolving right here. Yes, Shroomly. Oh, my God. Look at that. It wants to learn Mega Drain. Okay, so, yes, take away the Absorb. So, yes, we're going to be making a, a, a pretty good, a very, very good team by the end of this whole walkthrough. I hope it's a... Uh, I hope it's to the liking of you guys. It's going to be some Pokemon that I never, ever used. That that that, it, that, that right there is the wish, because, you know, obviously, one of the Pokemon that I've never used ever on my team is, you know, Voltorb Electrode, and look at this. It's kicking some butt, taking some names, and now... It's got me thinking that, yeah, maybe we should switch it up right here in Alpha Sapphire. Make it just, uh, make it fun. Let's make it fun right here. So, here we go, taking on a Nose Pass. And, well, as many of you guys already know, Nose Pass is a tank of a Pokemon. But not tanky enough. Alrighty. And, there we go, getting some more experience points. And, there we go, Ultra Psycho. Growing levels. I'm loving that. Okay, so... Let's see, let's go right ahead and continue on our battles right here. And let's go ahead and switch up our Pokemon here too. Now, I only brought three Pokemon from the main team just because I wanted to train everybody else. Hopefully by the end of this, you know, little side quest we'll have something. And yes, as many of you guys have predicted, you are going to continue on with the Trick Houses right here. I think we have two more things. I think we have two more uh, Trick House events that we have to do. Maybe even three. So, here we go. Carvana, how's it going? Here comes the Electro Ball. And just like that, Electro Ball finishes off Carvana. Like I said, I am going to capture every single Pokemon from previous generations. Previous teams have them right here. And, well, look at this. Pokemon are growing like crazy. So there it is. Okay, so let's see. There should be an item right here somewhere. Hmm. Yes, we are finding an item right here. Here we found ourselves a big pearl before the actual item. So let's see. Let's grab this. And we found ourselves an iron. Now, let's see. Is there anything else that we could actually find right here? Nothing. Except for maybe one thing towards the very end of this this here location so let's continue on and as you guys can see this looks familiar looks very very familiar if you guys remember this we were at the desert at one point and there was a similar structure of this you know over at the uh, over at the at the desert area later on in our adventure we're gonna be doing the Reggie's event and that's what this is where the Reggie's are gonna be located at so, let's see. Let's get the heck out of here. And not attack more Pokemon. And, uh, well, let's see. I don't know why I did that. I think we've already defeated everybody right here. Okay, so let's move on with our lives right here. And there might be a hidden item right here. Look at that. Okay. It's usually around a pebble or stone. And here we found ourselves a, a heart scale. Which, of course, will help us teach Pokemon or help us uh, with teaching Pokemon some new moves and well looks like this is route 106 right here so let's see let's go right ahead and locate some more Pokemon trainers yeah we're gonna be beating every single one of these guys up so what's up this is my backyard I'm not going to take it easy just because you're a kid mm-hmm you know that's what they all say and then eventually they get beat Okay, so here we go, taking on a Goldeen, and Thunderball right here is looking uh, very happy to meet you, so here we go, Thunderball going with, bam, 
Electro Ball for the win. Okay. And, well, let's see. Ultra Psycho grows to level 16. That right there is Digivolution time because, yes, we have to do it. So, here it is. Ultra Psycho is evolving finally. Now, it took us a while to actually get this guy, but you know what? Glad that we did. I would have loved to use this Pokemon here in Pokemon uh, Alpha Sapphire, but we already have a Pokemon that's just a little bit better than this guy, and it's because of the typing. And, well, there it is, guys. We got ourselves Kadabra. And, well, Kadabra's finally learning Confusion. That right there will help us. Eh, it'll help us in the long run, too. And, yes, I am planning on teaching... Or, I'm planning on, uh... What was it called, um... Oh, yeah. Wait, we haven't battled that guy? Holy crud. Or did we? I think we already battled this guy. Yeah, we battled him. Next see. If his Pokemon come out at level 25 or above, then yes, we have battled them. And yeah, we battled them. Okay, so time to finish this guy off right here. And there we go. Oh my god. There you go. Grabbing some more points right there. And Shroom Lee just growing up right here. And here comes a Gyarados. This right here is a dream. Oh, look at this Pokemon. He thinks that it's Intimidate will finish me off. Okay. Here we go, and here comes the Electro Ball. And just like that, Electro Ball beats a Gyarados. How is Gyarados not a Dragon-type Pokemon is beyond me. And, well, look at that, more points. Ultra Psycho is just growing the levels and learning Disabled right here. Hydra. Yes, learning Dragon Rage. Okay, so let's go ahead and take away Splash, because literally, Splash doesn't do anything. Not one bit. Okay, and of course, Shroom Lee grows another level right here and is learning Headbutt. Yeah, let's take away Tackle Attack because it's not that powerful. Alrighty. Okay, so let's see what's next. Hmm, I think I think we already got the item right here. Okay, so I think we're done. I think we're done with this. Okay, so. Let's go right ahead and move on with, you know, what's left right here. And, uh, well, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yes, let's put on another repel and see where we're going next. Cause, yes, there is one more trainer right here. He's like, <laughs> I'm a lousy runner, but in the water you can't catch me. I just, I just captured you. I literally just captured you right here. So, let's go right ahead and battle this guy. And, well, let's see what ends up happening. Okay, so he has himself a Gyarados, which is always fun, and well, let's go right ahead and go with an Electro Ball right here. Just like that, bam, we're getting some more points. Now, why can't all these trainers have some freaking Gyaradoses? I swear to God, okay. So there we go, Gaia grows to level 36, Ultra Psycho, growing levels like crazy, and uh, bam. Okay, so that's more points than what we could get. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Is there another trainer wanting a piece of us before we finish off? And yes, I am going to catch you. I can see you in your face. You want to challenge me. Uh, I challenge everybody. And right now, right now we're, we're, we're doing a pretty good job right here. So here we go. Take it on a Whalmer. And a Thunderball ready to go. Ready to finish you off. And here we go, another Electro Ball for the win. And wow, Whalmer defeated. Okay, alrighty. And well, look at this. Shroomly is finally coming into its own. I'm kind of hoping in the next episode it will evolve. And well, that right there is our little adventure towards Route 105 to 106. So in the next episode, guys, we will be going through the next routes, which I believe is, let's see, let me take a look at this right here. And we will be going through Routes 107, Routes 108, Routes 109, and Slateport. Now, I did see something about Kalos right here. People from uh, come swimming from as far away as from Kalos to see the site of the Mobile. Okay, so... If we were to make a map 
How would everything look in the Pokemon world? I just want to know that. Maybe you guys can answer that in the next episode. So, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being patient as always. I'll be back for another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. See you guys.